Hey, welcome back to Delectable You. Today we are making vegan, gluten-free pie crust because you know what? Thanksgiving is really almost here. And I know with Thanksgiving comes apple pie and pumpkin pie and pecan pie and who knows what other kinds of pies. And for those of you who are looking for an alternative to gluten and dairy and eggs, well, I've got one for you. This vegan and gluten-free pie crust is from an awesome book. It's called The Flying Aprons Gluten-Free and Vegan Baking Book. I love it. I get a lot of my bread and pie crust recipes from it. And I just do a little adapting to my tastes. So let me show you how to make this pie crust. So grab yourself a stand mixer fitted with a paddle attachment. If you don't have one of those, don't worry. Just use a regular hand mixer or you can just use a good old fashioned fork. So to this, you're gonna add a cup of brown rice flour and a half a cup of sweet sorghum flour, quarter of a teaspoon of salt, a half a cup plus three tablespoons of coconut oil that's been melted down three tablespoons of maple syrup, and about a tablespoon of cold water. So let's just mix this all together until it's nice and combined. All right, we have our dough. Now let's dust a work surface and roll this out. Okay, so clear the decks. Make sure you have enough space so that you can take a handful of brown rice flour and you're just gonna dust the work surface because you're going to put your dough on top of the surface and roll it into a ball. And you don't want it to stick. So that's good enough. Now let's grab our dough and just put it down there. All right, so now let's just Combine it all together. Just kind of, it's like playing with Play-Doh, because it kind of is Play-Doh. Just get that all nice and together. And that is it, my friends. That is your vegan, gluten-free pie crust. All right, so from here, you can put this in some plastic wrap and put it in the freezer and take it out when you're ready to use it or you can use it right away. You just roll it out, bake it the pie crust, and then make whatever pie you're gonna make with it. So I'm gonna use this crust next time to make a vegan gluten-free pumpkin pie just in time for the holidays. Um, but in the meantime, go ahead and experiment with your own pie recipes, and I will see you here next time. Thank you so much for joining me. This has been Lauren with Delectable You. Enjoy your pie crust.